And you can see this TV is perfect besides it's blue. This is a TV that I was replacing for somebody and I was about to throw it away and I was like, hmm. So I looked it up on the Google machine and I found out that uh, this is a common problem when your screen is blue like this, you just have to replace the backlight. It's about 50 bucks to replace the LEDs and we're gonna try it. Backlight strips, 10 pieces, so 10 of these strips is in the back of that TV. So let's open it up. ribbons that connected to here. Well, these things are attached to the panel underneath. So here's how this works. You see this little black lever? You're gonna pop it up towards you or up and that releases these ribbons just like that. So if you lift up, there's enough play in there. Pull up and pull it out like that. Good job, keep going. And this little chip right here looks like the entire Roku. It says Roku on there. Um, it looks like it's, that's what powers the Roku. This little dude thing right there. Worst case, uh, I put the whole TV back together and it just doesn't turn on. Oh, that's not the worst, I guess. Worst case, I uh, put the TV back together and turn it on and it bursts into flames and I have to use the fire extinguisher. It's like a fitted bed, bed sheet. Aha, fitted bed sheet theory is correct. Suction cups, now these are super cheap on Amazon. Suction one, suction two, and this should just lift off. What's it look like under there? I can't see. Where am I supposed to put this? This probably isn't the best, but I found a long piece of clean cardboard and I put it on top of the car. Whatever, that's the only spot I had out here. All right, next step is to remove these borders somehow. Four screw, all right, well there's a bunch of screws. So I guess remove this. Boom. Why do we tape them together? I'm assuming so they don't become misaligned. Could use the suction cups for this too. But I don't have any more. And in fact, I'm running out of space here. All right, and here we are. Can you see these things? Clips here. I don't know how they come out. Oh, geez. Uh, remember that whole thing where I said, uh, be careful? Yeah. Why is this thing stick? Is there more glue? There's glue. So, man, you need some uh, LEDs. Okay, so the theory is Take one of these LED strips, put it right here. Look, here's the new one, there's the old one. They look pretty damn similar. And we're gonna move that connector over to that thing. We're gonna move these, remove these screws. One, two, three, four on each of these. Voila, all the LEDs are replaced. So let's put everything back together and plug it in. Closely, you'll see these little nubs on the end of the ribbon. If you look down there, there's little nub holders. It's back together. So let's plug it in. A little nervous. I don't know why. Nothing happening. <laughs> uh, uh, it's blinking. Dudes. It f***ing worked. Free! You know how much a brand new uh, 55 inch 4K TV costs? Look at this. That's not blue or purple anymore. That's close to real color. 4K TV and we're about to throw it out because it's got a blue screen. No! I mean, you could probably do this in two hours. Thanks.